Cam. We're down to a, a baker's dozen. 13 games remaining. It's the Kings and the Nashville Predators kicking off a five-game homestand right here at Staples Center. Matt Roy sweeps the puck up the boards. Carl Grunstrom gets it to center red. Wayne Simmons jumps to the loose puck. Here come the Predators into the zone. Bonino shooting into the glove. Of Quick tosses it ahead. Martinez swivels it up the wall. Chopped at twice, a third time by Ayafalo. Ellis holds him back, and Forsberg pries the puck free. Pulls and drags, shoots off of Quick. Yossi has it again. It's exactly what I'm talking about, that cycle they want to get going. So far, the Kings, good job containing. Ayafalo lifts it through to Foley, shoots right on. Rene makes the save, and he's out of his crease. And he's going to be a big body going to the front of the net. Now it has not worked at all. The Kings very aggressive up the ice. There's Matt Roy shorthanded, tossing one off the blocker of Rene. It's very difficult to do, but something tells me they're just kind of waiting for the play. They, they, they have it built. They've had some experience now. They're just kind of waiting to get there. Greg Smith shooting off perhaps the knob of a Quick's goalie stick and keeps the cycle going. Yeah, I know the NHL is more of a rush attack game right now, but still, cycle is very important to wear down some teams. Kings doing it here. Opatar shoots off of Rene. Here's Doughty again as he stick handles and locates Kopitar. Dying seconds of the power play. Touch pass to Brown. Kovalchuk looking to clean up the rebound, but Rene made the stop. Here's Johansson on a two-on-one with Arvidsson at his flank. Johansson to Arvidsson. They score. So Nashville kills the penalty and capitalizes on the two-on-one. Arvidsson with his 29th. Watch the save. Rennie's just trying to get there. He's trying to get as close to Kovalchuk as possible. Then on the bounce, it's interesting to watch because this is how you set things up. Keep an eye on the top left. Watch Arvidsson right there. You see him open up. That is the cue to Johansson to get him the puck. He's opening up as the one timer. Johansson senses doubt he's going to go down and then lifts the puck. At the end of the day, the Predators are <laughs> looking for goal scoring. Pass gets all the way through to Dowdy, a shot gloved by Rene. Good adjustment by the goaltender. I think the goaltender senses the puck has to be elevated, so you're not looking for a low one anymore, and he makes the glove save. Feeds it out, Arvidsson couldn't settle the bouncing puck, and Dowdy ensures that he doesn't get to it. Final seconds, and the horn sounds to end period number one. Spins away from Brown, keeps the puck, Forsberg through the middle, lost it in the end. Opatar and I follow, skate out. Lifted. All right, follow. Kopitar got it back. Shot it right on. Rene with the save. Brown going after the rebound. Kopitar there as well. Two. And solid contacts here on the shift. Clifford on the receiving end. Roy to Lewis. Centering pass. They score! Austin Wagner in front of the goal has tied it. This is a type of thing they practice time and time again in practice where you have a cycle, you start it again. You have a cycle, you start it again. You keep going. Remember, Wagner was in the corner initially, circled all the way around, had the play in front of him, decided when to drive, pass was right there, and the Kings make a cycle work. We're tied 1-1. It's now 10 goals for the rookie, Austin Wagner. I have follow. Pokes it ahead. Kopitar worms away in the corner. Up the boards, feeds it rink wide. Forward, wrist shot, tipped on the goal, and Rene couldn't see the puck. They got his pad in the way. Clifford fed it to Roy. Couldn't hold the zone and then held his ground against the oncoming Boyle. Quickly, it's Lewis over the line. Lewis shoots, save, Rene, rebound, couldn't be covered. Clifford whacking at the puck. Let's see if the Kings can do exactly what they've been doing, keep control. Kopitar stops up, centers the puck. Dustin Brown corrals. Kopitar gets it back. Dowdy one-timer blocked. Brown to the rebound, steered it to the corner. Here is Johansson, exchanges the puck with Ekholm. That long toss is kicked away by Quick. Forsberg sends it behind. Arvidsson disrupted by Quick. Loose puck, and it's pounced on by Ekholm, but he missed a wide-open goal. Knocks it deep. Arvidsson gains some room on Roy. Forsberg walks it out of the corner. Cycles the puck to Yannick Weber. Weber tries to spin on Grunstrom. Backhanded shot saved by Quick. And he covers. As Smith. Plays it up the wall. Yossi helps it along. Yarkrop hands it off. And that shot by Sissons. Altered, and they score on the loose puck. Craig Smith finished it off.
The initial shot hit a stick. And then Smith, right place, right time, was there to bat it in. 2-1 Nashville. Ayafala was the first man back. He was the deepest man, but he's not a defenseman. Alec Martinez is trying to get back into position, but he never could get the, the half step back against Smith. And that's just one of those unfortunate bounces, but it's also an example of a player driving to the net, beeline to the net. 2-1 Preds. Curling his way into the zone, shooting off a of quick pad. Arvidsson going for the rebound. The second one collected by Forsberg. Turnaround bid gets blocked. And Nashville holds the puck into the zone. Flipped by Downey under the stick of Arvidsson. He waits. He shoots. Trying to bank it off of Quick in the end. Forsberg was in the blue paint as well, but couldn't connect. He takes it off, I think, his, his chest or his hand, and then it goes right into his face. He does wear a visor. Roy backtrack. Martinez, Ooh. pass picked off. Here comes Sissons, scores! Colton Sissons gets it past quick. And Nashville with back-to-back -back goals makes it 3-1. Exchanges it with Kempe. Kempe stick handles, head fakes against Subban, circles and sends it up top. Ledoux to Phaneuf. He waits, finds to Foley. Goal line to Foley, up top, Phaneuf a drive into the glove of Rene. You stick with it, now you have a lead. and. They want to keep their foot on the gas pedal. Shot saved by Quick. Rebound underneath him. The draw went after it after the initial shot from Grimaldi. Shooting right between the legs of the defender, looking for the legs of the goaltender. 14 goal. As a fourth oh. line, if you have that. Now, the top guys have to, to get back to their normal production. Then you have it going. Centering pass to Foley. Missed the net. Martinez fires off of Rene. Foley looking for a sixth sense. You can see how wide open the play then. And he shot wide on the play, but that was point blank right down the middle. Goudreau protects, flips it to Yossi, a shot. Quick reaches out the glove, knocked it down at least. Start a four check. Unable to do so. Yarncroke able to get there in time, but Smith arrives and tosses one on the goal quick. Yeah, look out here. It's a three-on-one now. Arvidsson across, but through everybody. Late stick. Got it. And the Kings turn up ice with a three-on-two. Brown to forward to Kopitar. Back to Brown. Couldn't get enough of it. He's also playing some pretty smart D here in the third. Kopitar slices his way through the traffic. Brown out wide. Brown shot is gathered by Rene. Ekholm up the boards, forward kicks it along. Leipzig to Kovalchuk, on for Dowdy, back to Kovalchuk, a wrist shot, save Rene, loose puck, they jam away, and Rene covers up. Well, the Kings do finally get a second whack at it. It's been a while to try to get to that point. The Kings able to get second and third opportunities, and uh, the National Press, kind of a workmanlike approach tonight. Kings had it going in the early part of the second period. From that point on, the Predators take over. They win it 3-1. to one. Well, It's the first win for the Predators in regulation in a nine-game span. They take it 3-1 to one over the Kings.